Hey guys, I hope you're all doing well today. This is going to be kind of a quick video on how to get Arma 2 DayZ, um, how to install the mods for it, how to play Arma 2 DayZ Epoch, Overwatch, whatever the mod is, or play Arma 2 DayZ Vanilla. I will divide it in two uh, parts, which will be first Vanilla and second is going to be the rest because uh, of my experience and I will explain you why did I do that. Um, first of all, yes, for Arma 2 DayZ Vanilla or overall for Arma 2 DayZ, you need to get Arma 2 and Arma 2 Operation Arrowhead. If you haven't got both of them, your DayZ mod won't work. This makes it Arma 2 Combined Operations and you need to install Arma 2 DayZ mod to play Vanilla. Basically, when this is all installed, if you want to play DayZ Vanilla, you have to click here uh, by clicking on Arma 2 DayZ mod. You have to go in the server list and manually find the server you want to play, but you have to make sure it's Arma 2 DayZ Vanilla mod, which is Vanilla <coughs> vanilla game, Vanilla server, Vanilla everything. Vanilla is only going to work through this. Uh, why am I doing this in like two parts for Vanilla and the rest? Because previously when I tried to play the Vanilla, I was always using DayZ launcher and Vanilla didn't work for me. Maybe it works for others, you can give it a try, but if you click on a vanilla server to daisy launcher, it doesn't work. Well, it didn't for me, so if I want to play vanilla, I usually click here, I go play, and I go to servers, I find it manually, and I enjoy the vanilla, good old vanilla stuff. But, if you want to play Epoch, other maps, um, other kind of mods for Arma 2 Daisy, you need to get daisy launcher. Daisy Launcher is a basically launcher which lists the servers and gives you the opportunity to install the mods you need automatically in, uh, instead of getting them manually and uh, doing all the folder and all the rest of the bullshit basically. I will leave the link in the description for Daisy Launcher. I will show you how to install it as well but personally I think it's not rocket science first of all and second of all I tried it before to make a video and I fucked up my mods so I don't want to do that. So basically, yeah, you download it, you install it, and this is where you're gonna get. Uh, you go to settings, make sure that your Arma 2 path is uh, selected here. This is Arma 2, not Operation Arrowhead, but Arma 2 only. Uh, mods and download path. I have got it on Drive C, the game is on Drive D. I would recommend to have it on the same path. Um, Maybe it doesn't work like that for Arma 2 DayZ, for Arma 2, uh, but I know for a fact that when I was trying to play Mother DayZ standalone, because my mods were not on the same path as DayZ standalone, I had lag spikes and um, I had some issues with the game. As soon as I put it all together on the same drive, it was all good, so yeah, I would recommend to have it on the same one even... I will try it myself actually, if it fixes anything for Arma 2 but I don't really have any that much problems with it so I just leave it like this but I do recommend whatever it is Arma 2, Arma 3 Exile or Daisy Standalone I recommend to have it on the same drive. Make sure it's all selected there, selected there and then you save it. Mods. Most of the servers for you will have this icon here which means download the mod so basically when you have a play button you can just literally straight play but don't think you'll be able to if you've got a lot of space on your drive i recommend you to go to mods and download everything and then you won't have to worry about anything at all or the second option is you just go down to server list you pick the server you want to play on it will have this icon here that means you haven't got the mod for the server so you click on the arrow down it will ask you if you want to install the mods you will click ok you will go to your mods tab and you will see it's downloading the mod you need and that's pretty much it you just after that then click play and enjoy the daisy experience the good old daisy and as i said before for arma 2 daisy vanilla i would personally recommend you to go to steam click it here and search your vanilla server manually and play it there it might work for you from here, but it didn't for me, so I'm not sure how it works in the end. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, leave a like if you liked it. Share it with someone who needs information how to get Arma 2 DayZ. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing because I have, will have a lot of content in uploads coming out in the near future. And I do stream quite a lot as well. 
uh, Monday to Friday I stream about 7 8 p.m. UK time for a couple hours and on the weekend Saturday Sunday I could come live any minute day night doesn't matter but it's a long long stream so yeah make sure to click the notification button to see when I go live or I post a new vid thank you again for watching and I hope this helps and I will see you in the next one